parking on it. I guess there's going to be underground parking too. I always like doing the intro. Good morning, afternoon, or evening, whenever you guys are tuning in and creeping with. Much appreciated. If we are here at the Gresham Library, the little intro opening clip there, that was the construction of the brand new one, East Multnomah County Library. And I've utilized these guys for a lot of things throughout the years for the vlog and just research, checking books out, things of that nature. And they just upgraded their system where you can get online and find old publications and there's also a trick where you could do it at home as long as you have a library card Multnomah County library card with the number I digress we're doing some creeping but I wanted to start here at the Multnomah County library Gresham because this will be no longer here very soon with that new one underway but I've utilized these guys many of times stay tuned we're doing some creeping in fact I always like this little foyer they got a ton of information. I come here and grab the actual paper, the Lamont Week or the Mercury or my go-to. But they also have a ton of information of activities that are gonna be happening. Got some sea otters. Oh, I'm cute. And a bunch of other things. Oh, this'll be nice. February 24th, the Fix-It Cafe. You can bring your items down here and they'll help you get them all fixed up. But yeah, they got a ton of community events and things going on. So yeah, it's getting ready to be a new one coming in. So kind of just documenting this library while we can. We did a full video on it not too long ago. It's like some kids that got their little Legos on display. Lego club. That's neat. I also wanted to show you guys right over here. I believe... In this pillar here, or maybe it's where this light is, there's actually a time capsule buried inside this wall when they very first opened this library. They actually buried a little time capsule right in here. So hopefully they'll utilize this, or you know, unbreak it when this finally closes, they open the new one. We'll see. There's some more Legos too. Pretty neat though, I love this. Library, I'm gonna hate to see it go. Not to mention the uh, carpeting in here too. It looks like I got some lanterns in here too for the uh, New Year, Chinese New Year. But yeah, this carpet is weird. Kind of reminds me of a, uh, what's the movie? Timberline Lodge, Shining. <laughs> I wanted to show you these uh, Beverly Cleary statues of Ramona Beverly Cleary being a Portland famous Portland author. I'm hoping that they uh, can keep these as well. This a kid scene. If you guys remember Beverly Cleary, there's also some statues down at uh, Grant Park that they did of the, all the different characters. And of course, the Sister City Japan statue here from May of 92. So, a lot of cool art in here, too, that I hope they save when the new one goes in. We'll see. Uh, brand new microfiche which has been super helpful looking up old articles and information of Portland and things like that so they updated it last time we were here it was kind of like an old school system so pretty neat and it's been very helpful and then they've got all these computers in here as well to utilize but yeah this has been really cool so good to see hopefully they can get some more of these at the new one all these cool paintings on this side all 
right. Yeah, I like this area, this where this one sits. The other one's right by the train, which will be nice if folks can just jump on the train and utilize the library that quick. But I kind of like this one. It's a little bit more quaint, kind of hidden. <laughs> but starting to rain now, but that's okay. We're still going to do a little creeping. Got the creeper cruiser locked up over here. Yeah, we'll see what happens here at the Gresham Library. I'm not sure what they're going to use it for once this new one opens. I'll keep you guys posted though for sure. All right. Got the Creeper Cruiser double locked. We're going to pop back into Dick's Sporting Goods where we actually purchased the Creeper Cruiser. I'm in the market for one of those little back fenders that go over the back tire to keep the water off of me. Go in here and see what they got. All right. Here's all their bikes. Oh yeah, we lucked out. They're back up to 600. Paid like 315 for mine. Let's see if they have any of these little fenders. I'm not really seeing any. I'm just seeing seats and stuff. I got some pumps and helmets. All I'm seeing is seats and like gloves and whatnot. Here's a cargo rack. That's kind of what I want. I've already got something similar to that, but I need just the piece that kind of goes over the back tire. Oh, here we go. Right here. So 25. Seat post clamp. Yeah, it's a little pricey. I was hoping to find it a little bit cheaper. We're gonna keep looking, but at least I know it's here in case it does start to downpour on me. <laughs> Dang, look at this one. Literally uprooted and took the whole sidewalk with it. That's crazy. <laughs> Dang, dude, that thing is no joke. Took the whole sidewalk up. And, look at this one. Same. Oh wow, looks like these guys got their house hit too. They got it tarped off. That's wild. Yeah, a couple of them just took out the sidewalk. Looks like they got their house all tarped up too. There's another one down there as well. That's scary. And what are you doing still in bed? Huh? Are you still sleeping? Okay, I see you took my pillow too. Did you take my pillow? Okay, where's your little stuffy guy I got you, huh? Where's your little stuffed animal? Where's your little ball at that I got you, huh? Okay, see you in a bit, okay? Okay, take a little snooze, huh? Okay. February 2024. And... We literally just had a full snow moon. If it'll focus, there we go. Yeah, we had a full snow moon just a few nights ago, so. Yeah, I guess the weather, <laughs> I thought it was spring, but apparently not. It's like a little bit of blue skies coming in. We'll see what happens. Birds are chirping. That's going to do it for today. If you guys are new here, make sure you hit that red subscribe button. That'll dial you into being a creeper today. You can also ring that bell. That way when I creep, you guys will be the first to creep. And if you did enjoy this, give it a thumbs up. Till next time, creeper out for now. Peace.